Hello, welcome or welcome back. Today I am so excited because I am participating in a collab that is for my girl Riri. It is her birthday today. Happy birthday, Riri. I wish I was there with you to take tequila shots and tacos. <laughs> she does say that in her videos. That's the only reason why I say that I don't do tequila, so I'll take water shots. Just kidding, I'll take vodka. <laughs> but we we, there is, there is more than one of me, there are a lot of ladies doing this today. I will link a spreadsheet of women that are doing this club. There's a lot of women that I do know, and there's quite a bit of women that I don't know. So I'm very excited to go meet everybody, go watch their videos, see what they do. Well, I know that we're all doing... Here, I'm going to get started because I'll never finish. <laughs> I am a bit I'm very excited to see what questions they write, what questions, because that's what we're doing today. We're answering questions about Riri, and I'm so excited. I'm, this is going to be epic, <laughs> because I scoured the internet like a stalker just to find, hopefully, some information, and I didn't get any. <laughs> well, I did, but I didn't. You know what I'm saying? So, I want to... Let's just start with the questions. Okay, okay, this is gonna be hard. All right, so the first question is, how old am I today on March 5th? If you guys have been following Darissa for a while, you will have seen maybe a couple months back she was doing three facts about herself at the bottom of her description and it said that she was 40. So I know today you are 41. So happy birthday once again. I know I'm going to be saying that a lot during this video, so be prepared. <laughs> but yes, today you are 41. Which, dang, if I look that good at 41, I feel like I already look older than you. Okay, okay, Darissa. So congratulations. <laughs> Alright, next question. Let's see. What are my husband and son's names? First and foremost, I don't know your husband's name because I looked all over on Instagram to find that out and I can't find a dang thing. All I can see is that you call him a sexy man, <laughs> your man crush Monday, your husband, all that good stuff. But I do know that your son's name is Caleb. It's spelled K-A-I-L-E-B and my name is spelled K-A-I-L-E-E. -E. Another reason why you like me. I know, I know. <laughs> I'm very into myself today. This is my attitude today. <laughs> if you're not into that, sorry. <laughs> Number three, what are my go-to shadows? <sighs> I laughed because I filmed this video yesterday with those shadows. I completely forgot that it was supposed to be a pink and yellow look. Your go-to shadows are green. I know you love green shadows in your eyes, and that's what I did yesterday. It was a green look, and then I realized it wasn't supposed to be that. <laughs> so, in, in order for me to follow the rules, I deleted that video and came on again today. <laughs> I'm just taking my NYX palette in this, this second shade right here. I'm hoping to hit pan in it. It doesn't seem like it's going to be happen in, happening in this decade. I'm, I'm not, I'm not too thrilled about it. <laughs> oh, and the fact that you, Darissa, said that I was your inspiration for project painting. Thank you so much. That means the world to me. It, it really does. It To know that I can inspire somebody to do something is just the most incredible feeling and I love it. So thank you. Thank you so much for that. Which I'm going to go ahead and take a break from the questions and talk about Riri because I think she's just an amazing person that wants you to be positive in life. She doesn't want like you, she she completely understands anxiety, depression, all that good stuff. <laughs> but she wants 
the best for people. She truly does. And it, that comes across on her channel and it just, she gave, I, I, I'm touching my necklace because this is what she gave me. She actually gave me a earring and bracelet set, but I, I didn't want to wear it today. <laughs> I wanted to wear this necklace because it says she believed she could, so she did. And I feel like it's just a powerful statement and plus the jewel on it is blue and I absolutely love it. And the other little thing right here is a unicorn. <laughs> I'm not into unicorns, but I love the rest of it, so I'm okay with it. But I absolutely love this necklace so much. So, so much. So I wear it all the time. You probably don't see it in my videos because when I'm getting ready, I don't normally have all my outfit and makeup on. <laughs> like today, this is not what I'm wearing. I'm still in my pajamas. Which, if you had a birthday party, this is what I would be doing. Is being in my pajamas and doing makeup with you and taking tequila shots and eating tacos. <laughs> Alright. Next. Well, not in the morning at 6. <laughs> Alright, next is number four. What are my favorite makeup brands? I know for eyeshadow you love and Anastasia Beverly Hills. I remember us talking a few months ago and you saying that you didn't really like ColourPop because of the staying power on your eye, but I see you dabbling in a little bit of ColourPop, so I hope your opinion has changed at least slightly. And then what are your other favorite brands? I don't know. <laughs> so I'm not even going to talk out, out my butt like I do know. So let's continue. <laughs> Ooh, one eyeshadow that you have been loving lately is the Jackie Ina palette. Yes. Yes. And then what is one of my favorite scents? I truly, truly don't know this one. So if I were to guess, it would probably be something fresh and something clean and not like Clorox bleach. <laughs> uh, jeans or leggings? I think you're a leggings lady. Yes? Because it's hard to find jeans for us ladies. Now, let me tell you how I found, I found Garissa, okay? I was on the hunt for somebody who was around my build, my size, and I was looking into fashion. I'm gonna go into this Flamingo palette and into the pineapple shade. I've been using this as a mirror. It has a great mirror. But I'm going to put that on a flat brush and go along my lid. So, like I said, I was looking for somebody for fashion advice and I saw her try on haul or something like that and it was her very first one so I was like oh what what is this lady into and I clicked on her channel and it just so happened to be makeup like I was into so I started following her she started following me and we've just been friends ever since and that's how I love relationship relationships because it's so organic and it's just wonderful I have loved her since the moment I saw her <laughs> Because she is a size 20 and I'm a size 18. 18, 20, depending on the on the size. We all know that struggle, right? But not the struggle of the size, but struggle of being one size and the other at the same time. That's what I meant. <laughs> but she, as of I think the beginning of this year, has been on this journey of eating more healthy like I am, I am going, steering towards a more plant-based diet than I was, the diet that I call, that I had was the American-based diet, which I'll let you Google that if you want because that's not what this video is about, but she's keeping herself accountable via Instagram and via not necessarily YouTube, she is talking about it every now and then, but not, she's not a fitness channel, you know what I'm saying, so. 
and girl, if you want somebody <laughs> to come with you on this journey and like be with you and keep each other accountable, I'm so there for you. You just be, you just slide in my DMs and you just let me know. <laughs> I'll be there for you. All right, let's go with the next question, which is summer or winter? Gosh, I don't even know where you live, so I don't know. If you live down south, I bet you hate summer and you're all right with winter, but I feel like you live up north, you hate winter and you're all right with summer. That's like the two differences. I've lived both up north and down south, so that's depending on where you live. <laughs> and if you live in the middle, I don't know. I have never lived in the middle. <laughs> all right, what is my motto slash mantra in every video? You're about positivity and you want people to take care of themselves you know because we we agree that no one is going to take care of you as much as you are you have a specific saying but I didn't write it down because I'm dumb <laughs> but you are all about taking care of yourself I absolutely know that because it, it gives me so much empowerment to hear someone else say it because it's almost like, okay, if you hear somebody else say it over and over and over again, you're going to start believing it. And then if you tell yourself that over and over and over again, you believe it. So, forgive me for not writing it down, but I know what it is basically about. So, uh, I have to appreciate you. <laughs> not have to, but I really, really do. Okay. All right, nine. If I could choose three makeup items what would they be if you could choose three makeup items or i could choose three makeup items mine is a chapstick mascara and blush <laughs> and i think you're good on two out of three i think you would choose the chapstick and mascara I, my only thought was you would probably choose highlight yeah yeah all right um in your own words, what does makeup mean to me? To me, to me, to me. Oh. To me, makeup means accentuating what you already have. It, or it's playful time. It can be something when you're bored it can be playful it can be fun it can be just an escape from something else you know what I'm saying like if you're bored I'm gonna go back into that pink shade and put it on my outer corner because I didn't do that oops <laughs> but it's just something I love makeup Okay, I don't know what I would be doing without makeup. I don't feel like I would be ugly without makeup. I feel like makeup is makeup and it should accentuate what you have. It should make you feel happy and it shouldn't hide what you have and you should be happy with you. You know what I'm saying? Like it takes, and that, say, and that sounds like easier than it really is, but it's, it's empowering to feel good and then just add makeup, makeup on top of that to make you feel like extra and you feel great with it. That's what I want makeup to be for people. And oftentimes it's not, unfortunately. And I just want, what does makeup mean to me? That's what it means. <laughs> I'm not gonna go any further because you get it, right? You get it. I feel like I didn't explain myself well, but. I know you get it. It's okay. Okay, so right now I'm battling the sun. <laughs> you can see it coming through on my face. This like blue little hue right here from my bathroom window. So at the end, I am going to be shooting a picture of what the look looks like today. Just so you guys can see it all in its super form. 
got at least some of these questions right. <laughs> if I didn't get any right, that's okay. I clearly suck. <laughs> I'm going to take this shade Lemonade on a pencil brush. This is this is actually my favorite pencil brush, and it's from Morphe. And I don't like a lot of their brushes, but this brush is bomb. So if that tells you absolutely anything, they at least have one good brush. <laughs> I have learned a lot from Dorissa. Okay, so I'm going to tell you the things that I've learned from her. I have learned not to expect things from people, and especially in the aspect of YouTube in general, like for instance, I can't expect everybody that is subscribed to me watch every single video of mine, even though I may be watching every single video of theirs. If I see I've always been the type of person that's like, oh, well, if you're supporting my channel, I'm going to go over there and support your channel. And if I don't see you, I'm not going to go over to your channel. But thing is, life. Life gets in the way. We can't expect everybody to come over and watch our channel every single time. You can't expect everybody to watch every single video of yours because you may not like every single video that that person comes with or comes out with. You have to take it, take it with a grain of salt. Still be that person's friend. And get over yourself. <laughs> and that's not me talking to you. That's me talking to me. I, I had to get over myself. And I just value so much what she had. She taught me that. And, and, and clearly not in those words. I'm shortening it and also making it more an aha moment to myself more than I am to you but that's that's clearly not what she was trying to say she's not saying t to tell me to get over myself but that's what I took from it that's what I learned that's what I appreciate that I have learned and I'm much happier I'm so much happier that I learned that so I have Teresa to thank for that. Also, the fact that, oh, <laughs> this is going to sound so rude, but it's not meant to be. Teresa, your audio has gotten so much better in the last four or five months that you've been on YouTube. I went back to your old videos, lady. Oh my goodness. I didn't even realize that it was bad until now. That it's wonderful and great and phenomenal. I didn't even know. I didn't even know. But it's so wonderful now. I'm just taking that pink shade once again that I'm trying to hit pan on on my lower lash line. Hoping that it's going to be pan in it at least sometime in my lifetime. Jeez. I've used it like 12 times and there's barely a dip in it. Unlike the other ones where I hit pan in within a matter of time like less than 20 times so i at least had a dip in those shadows by the time i hit 12 like i am now and this doesn't it's barely moved this one right here you see this dip you see these dips you see all that yeah i dug my finger in that oh no but do you see that it's not moving at all, and it's making me mad. I let my products get me mad, not my, not my subscribers. <laughs> or my friends. I don't know. I love Dorissa. If you don't know who she is, you're totally missing out. And I'm going to leave a picture of how I looked today. And I love you, Dorissa. I hope you had the most wonderful 41st birthday. That's so beyond insane that you're 41 because you look so damn good. Just saying. But you don't look 41. So I hope to look like you when I turn 40 old girl. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. So I'm going to leave the video here. I hope you all have a wonderful and fantastic day. Please go check out the other ladies that are doing this collab. I know I will be. So in saying that, I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.